started playing with my cheek against the guitar and then I wound up using my front teeth. And by doing that, the sound travels through the bone to my auditory nerve. And I can hear the guitar. As I was growing up, I'd get one ear infection after the other. It was really hard to realize it was happening. I think if we knew what was happening, I would have learned sign language or something like that. But because it happened so slowly, my world just got small. And when I was in third grade, I realized I'm losing my hearing. I learned to play the banjo to win a bet. I, t I wanted to be a musician in the worst possible way. And one day I was out in the front porch with my dear old dad, and he offered to teach me how to play the banjo. But being a kid, I gave him a little bit of a hard time, so he finally said, that's it, you've got the basics, teach yourself, but if you can teach yourself, I'll give you my new banjo. And a few weeks later, I walked away with this new banjo. <laughs> Once we started playing together, just after a few months, music, I could finally communicate with my father. And how lucky am I? I'm not just a musician, my father is my best friend. Actually, some days I'll take it off because I don't want to forget how precious this is. You can sometimes forget, you know, get busy, life goes on, and you don't stop to realize, like, 